Hey everybody, how y'all doing? This is Carla Y. Nix with today's inspiration. And as always, I'm here to encourage you and to remind you that you can live every day on purpose. Purpose is really the platform and the mission that God has given me uh, several years ago for me to speak on and to teach on and to write about and to just empower people and remind them about the the power of their purpose and um as such god continually gives me things to teach about write about speak about because he allows me to live these situations and i live them for a purpose for a reason and that is to encourage you you know i can speak on i can teach on i can talk about what i know and I can give a little more uh, weight to it because I can understand it. One thing I want to um, let you know, like I said, I lived through certain things. Trust me, it happens quite often that God will allow me to go through something that is indeed going to be helpful for somebody else. I've long learned um, that it's not about me. I might take things personally and I might feel it personally, but the bottom line, it really is not about me. It's like, now what am I to do with this? Okay, I, and I've said, I've, I've shared this many times um, with you that there's, you should always walk away with a lesson. There's a lesson in what you went through. Find out what it is that you're to learn from what you went through. Okay, so I want to pass that on to you. What am I to learn from this? Okay, I went through this, Lord. I, God, you brought me through this. What am I to learn? Well, one thing I know personally that I've learned is that the, especially the, the harder it is, the more difficult it is, the stronger I become because I went through it. And... Um, there's a song, it's a secular song, but it's, it has a lot of merit. I, I can't remember who made it. I want to think uh, Christina Aguilar, Christo, I can't pronounce it, but that girl can sing. Uh, thank you for making me strong. It's either her or either um, uh, Kelly Clarkson. But thank you for making me stronger because of what I've been through, what you put me through, you just gave me strength. You made me stronger because I had to go through it. Uh, so the situation, you either gone, gone. I hate to say it, but you either gonna die, or you gonna live. And if you live through it, you should be better for it. You should come out better. In fact, I was telling someone just today. I said I am better for what I just came through. I'm better for it. I'm gonna come out better. I and this is what I've been saying in my mind. What's been in my spirit the last few days? Is thank you for my wings. You've given me strength. You've given me wind to push me. You've given me wings to soar, even more so than I was. You know, so that situation that you're going through, or that you've been through, you can can come out better because you had to see while you were going through it. You had to utilize everything that you've learned, uh, everything that you read, everything that you knew. You had to now put that into action. You had to use what you knew. Use what you knew and and go forward. So you've learned that yes, God is indeed a rock in the weary land. I mean you used to sing about it, you used to read about it, you read it in the scriptures, you sang the song, and now you can tell about it because you you know that you know that you know. Because he has been your rock in the weary land. And I, I don't know where that came from, but I'm just using it for an example. Um, you know, without a doubt, that he will never leave you nor forsake you. That wasn't just words on a paper. It became real because you lived it. When he said in his life there will always be trials and tribulations. Yeah, you, you knew that because he said it. And you believed it because he said it. But now you know it because you went through it. So, I thank you for listening. And I want you to remember that you can do all things through Christ who strengthens you. 
because he is God and he will carry you through. Of course, yes, somebody just opened the door, so I have to go. But God bless you. This is Carla Y. Nix again with today's inspiration.